Oh hey guys, hello Vain here and today we're gonna play another spooky game and I'm so excited. Actually, I really really like this game, but I think that what this game is really lacking is some background story that would be so lovely. So let's just try and create a little bit background story right now while playing it. Because uh, the atmosphere and gameplay and the whole story was pretty nice. And actually, I kind of like it. So let's check it together, guys, and see, 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 see why I like this game so much. And let's just mess around with it a little bit. Hey! So, I don't know, I read it or not, but Mary's Nightmare, we are coming. So here is our game. We are in our bedroom. Pinky bedroom because we are princesses, I guess. So, once upon a time. First of all, why it's uh, 1 a.m. and we are not asleep? What the hell is wrong with us? Like, seriously. So if we click on this eye, we get into some uh, alternative dimension of our room, maybe? I don't freaking know, okay? And this is kind of creepy. And what is more creepy is here. You see? Just an arm appeared from freaking nowhere. And it's like, you know, hey. Oh, no, 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 no. So, it's like this. We can turn the radio on and please don't because it's really creepy. We can click on the clock and uh, <laughs> here tick tock tick tock tick tock like Moriarty, right? From the Sherlock's finale. We can click on this lovely place where the bird is laying. And we can click on our wardrobe that is closed for some unknown reason. So, okay. So, it's like... Like this. We're clicking on our bed. Like, why the hell would need to click on it? Whatever. <laughs> We're clicking it. And... Hey, little kids. You know, I was just laying here. For I don't know how many time. <laughs> like, you know, the, the thing with this game is that the creature just appeared from nowhere. Like, what the hell, we were living in this room for God know how many, how much time. And just one random night, this ghost decided to appear in front of us. Like, what the hell. Hey, kid. So, I've heard you had some problems with your wardrobe. Here's a key that I think can help you solve your little problem. And yeah, we obtained the key. And thank you, I guess. So, we can click on our key right now and on the wardrobe. And here's an eyeball, and that's so weird, like, why the hell, what the hell is wrong with us, and with our room that we have eyeballs in our wardrobe, like, who the hell are we, and who the hell are our parents, and, uh, I don't know, are we a kid, are we an adult, because, I don't know, at this point I freaking don't know, so we can click on what now? On clock, maybe? No, not clock. Oh, no, no, tick tock, tick tock, I like it. Yeah, tick tock, tick tock, tick tock, tick tock. And window, maybe? No. Oh, ha ha ha, jokes on you. What jokes? Okay, but with the light, we don't see anything. Okay. Oh, 
Is it something paranormal? You know, like when they record um, just ordinary stuff and then some ghost voices appear in the background? Someone is fighting, right? Just like that. So now our lovely clock is fluorescent. Why the hell someone gave our little ghost a fluorescent paint? You know, what the hell is wrong with... Okay, so, um, okay, fine. Fine. I don't know. Everything is normal. What? What? Oh, this is so lovely. We just found out an ear. Turn apart from someone. Okay. And now. Oh. Hey. Little sweetie. What the hell are you? <laughs> like, I get the girl. It's Mary. Uh, you, you know, the thing is, I don't freaking know what is her background story and I would really love to know because you see, what's sad is that this girl doesn't have an eye and an ear and her mouth is actually sued and this is so terrifying because maybe she was murdered somewhere in this house and that's so terrifying my friend is dying could you please save my friend and how the hell she's speaking because her mouth is kind of sweet but okay friend we need to s to cure her friend okay and now a bit a doll here that looks why the hell there is a bone in a doll and why the hell the doll is bleeding from the inside and is it like I don't know representation of our lovely girl here like uh, yeah it's Mary. It's kind of her in a doll way. Okay, so okay, we can put it up and up. No, okay, up, up you go. So what is this actually? It's not a bone. Is it like a plant or I don't know? What is it? What the hell was that? Seriously. Oh, so the girl was lacking an eye, an ear, and a heart. Like, what the hell happened to her? I would really love to know. Thank you for saving me from my nightmares. Good night and sweet dreams. You know, this is literally terrifying, and I guess that's the end of the game. Oh, no? We can close it, maybe? No? Another eye? What the hell? Okay, this is the end, guys. That's clearly the end. And what I want to say about this whole thing just a few moments ago, this game is pretty short and pretty easy, but it kind of disturbing because, as I said before, we don't freaking know what the hell is wrong with this Mary. I think she was murdered, seriously, I think she was murdered by some twisted, weird uh, serial killer because this uh, mask here with evil love, maybe it was a representation of her murderer, maybe. And uh, what I wanted to say just a few seconds ago before I start rambling, one more thing is so... <laughs> 
ironic about uh, this ending is that she said to us have nice sweet dreams how you know just some weird ghost girl appeared just right in front of us that maybe was there for decades watching us sleep etc and she just appeared and then was like oh thanks i think i'm gonna go you know i'm gonna go good night and now we're freaking done no were there any other ghosts with her watching us sleep at night and that's so disturbing this is so weird but okay guys there was mary's nightmare i freaking love this game but i think a little bit of uh, background story would be lovely to have i would love to know more about this mary girl about this weird doll about why the hell she was so obsessed with this uh, little bird here and why the hell the bird was dead actually what the hell was wrong with that bird and yeah about us also maybe we were also in some weird guy's house and there was a you know hello from the other side hello from the other side that told us that hey i think you pick up the wrong man to stay with <laughs> I don't know. So guys, that was Mary's Nightmare. If you want, you can check this game as always by yourself. And uh, I think that was all for today, guys. Bye, and I'll see you, I guess, soon. Oh, hey there once again, guys. Actually, I just found out that uh, I kind of missed <laughs> the great finale of this game. Like, how? How? even possible but we're talking about me so <laughs> it was possible anyway there is a final scene that kind of explained everything and confirms my speculations about this whole thing and uh, with that final part it's finally complete so i take back all my comments about background story background story is nice but i would love to know more about this weird creepy guy but anyway let's just see this final scene finally <laughs> how how it was possible to miss it i don't know i skipped it the first time i was just i, I thought it was just a static and screen and that's it and the second time i haven't even seen it like at all so okay that's so weird I'm sorry, what? What? What the hell is this? How the hell I missed it the first time? Like, what the hell? But okay... I guess fine? Good night? Sweet dreams! And finally, let's see this great finale. Mary's Nightmare. Also, this uh, final part was is a trailer to this game, and that's so nice. So let's see. Mary's Nightmare. Here's our Mary with her lovely doll. And here is um, her parents. Mom, Dad, I'm here. Please. Stop this! So, her parents were on the age of divorce, maybe. They were fighting a lot, etc. As I said, the radio, come on. Can you see me? Or maybe it was after. Maybe it was after. Maybe. Okay, her eyes bleed, ears are bleeding. That's why bleeding ear. Maybe. And here's her lovely bird. She took her bird with her? What's wrong with you, girl? Or is it just a backpack? Or is it a, really a bird? Okay. So then she met this nice gentleman. Look, you know, a nice little clown who turned out to be evil clown. How unexpected that uh, gave her a balloon, and that's how she lost her doll. 
then this Mr. Smiley Face turned out to be Mr. Murder Face. And then that's when he killed her bird. And her. Mom, Dad, I'm right here. So that's why her parents were fighting a lot because they lost her and they were... Or maybe it... I'm kind of confused now. Even after seeing this, they were fighting with her alive, right? That's why she left home and turned to that weird guy. And then, after she died, her parents just uh, became closer because of their loss. That's so sad. Can you see me? Oh, that's so sad. Hope, there are no more children. Haunted by nightmares. Aww. Aww. This is so sweet. This is really sweet. And now it's finally the end, right? No more secrets hidden. Okay. So that was the actual end of uh, Mary's Nightmare. Now this gameplay is much more complete and it makes more sense. But we kind of guessed it, right guys? Because that was pretty obvious for anyone. <laughs> so yeah, that was finally it. <laughs> Bye. And as always, you can click on the button down below and subscribe to this channel. And also check some of my previous videos out. Bye.